Hey Urban Adventurers, today we are at the Minnesota Tacoma's Facebook group Meet and Greet. We got a small group here today. We're gonna go check out the Tacomas. As you can see, you can see my Tacoma on the back and a few others. So yeah, let's go check out all these mods that these Tacomas have. We'll talk to some of these owners and and take a look at their Tacomas, see how they're rigged up and everything. All right, let's go check them out. Don Guzman, this is my uh, 2020 TRD Sport Tacoma. Uh, some of the bigger mods, the Ironman Foam Cell Pro Stage 2 kit. Uh, I've got the Diamondback SE cover in the back for security. Uh, running Billy Bars for the bed rack uh, with the Smitty Built tent on top of it. 3T PAM inside for power uh, and navigation. Dometic fridge inside, hardwired. Um, lots of other little goodies that I can't even remember at this point. So. Got lucky when I bought it, got the six speed manual transmission, uh, had the full LED light package already stock, so uh, a lot of things I didn't have to do. Um, running the BFG KO2s in 275, 70, 17 with the KMC uh, 541 Dirty Harry's. So that's about it. Greg Bendiger. Uh, this is my 2008 Tacoma pre-runner. Done a few visual mods to it. That's about it. It's been a fun truck. Uh, it was completely stock when I got it. Now it's just got a lot of visual upgrades and just been a fun truck to run around in.
Hi, my name is Jim. Drove the old girl down with 400,000 miles, still going strong. A lot of fun. It's our ultimate off-road machine. We don't baby at all, and still going great. Had a few hard knocks. We've got everything. We got bright lights. We upgraded our truck. We hired the engine, and it's a Toyota. And it's and the sticker says off road, so we should so we can know it's off roading. It's, it's meant for off roading, and this truck can go on rock, mud. Dirt, grass, This is my 2019 TRD Off-Road Tacoma here. So yeah, my name is Tommy. It's a 2016 uh, TRD off-road. Uh, got it bare bones stock. Um, so in the last like six months, I've kind of gotten a little nutty on the modifications. So we did Pro Grill with the Raptor lights, Cali Rays fogs, Cali Rays ditch lights, Victory 4x4 roof rack, uh, the Vision Manx wheels, with the Falcon Wild Peaks, 
um, pro skid plate underneath on the front and then blacked out all the the emblems with the Morimoto headlights um, smoked turn signals and then the billy bars for the rooftop tent rooftop tents 23-0 and then we got some traction boards we got the mountain hatch tailgate insert and then I mounted some axes and shovels and fire extinguisher in the bed and then on this side we just got a two gallon roto packs and then this side mirrors that side so I did the black TRD off-road emblem and then the black overlays as well and then an add a leaf in the rear for now to help with the extra weight and then on the inside I did a lot of the blackout kit for the inside and then the victory molly panels on the side of the center consoles there and that's it really off-road don't have the stickers it is uh, cement and it is a long bed um, there's a uh, pretty much pretty much stock for the most part besides just some overlanding stuff I got uh, Baja ditch lights with Rego fabrication mounts and then the rest of it after that is pretty much Kelly raised Kelly raised hidden light bar Kelly raised fogs and then Cali Race 32 inch inside the Prinzu. Prinzu top rack. Got a Plano gun case with uh, camping stuff in it. I got a Renogy 100 watt solar panel that runs inside to uh, run my uh, Blue Yeti AC50. Then I got a up top overland bed rack for the retracks with the retracks tonneau cover. I camper X cover, the normal one, not the mini, so it's king size. And then I got ski snowboard rack by Rhino Rack, the small one, the 572. Rhino Rack J hooks for the kayaks. Got a custom built table mount underneath there. It's a cheap table that we had laying around. I just built some mounts for it. Folds up. And then uh, got a full size roto packs. Yeah, got the mountain hatch, first gen, whole bunch. Got some Kelly Ray's bed stiffeners, some levelers, stuff like that. On the other side, I had my framed fat tire bike on a one up tray. Here, I got the pro style tail lights that are from Depot, and I got the Miso Stage 1 light kit. Um, pretty much factory blacked out tip, factory steppers, a couple of other things, not a whole lot. Pretty messy, full of stuff. Got a lot of Blue Ridge Overland gear on the other side and here. 
As you get a lot of the, the patches up there too. Yeah, nice. yeah, we got uh, all of a whole bunch of Minnesota state parks. Nice. Forests, and then I got some companies, and then I got some stuff from Washington, Oregon, Wyoming. Cool, awesome. And then in here I got a whole bunch of little stuff. I got the T-Pam, the two T-Pam. So that was the one that's not flush with a whole bunch of Ram stuff. And then just some other little miso doodads. And uh, it's got the technology package, moon roof. So it's got all that stuff. And then this is running for tacos. And these I won. I got another set too, but magnets. Cool, awesome. Thank you for sharing your truck. Yeah, no problem, man. You know, thanks for coming out and everything.